You talking to the turtle t-shirt wearing, championship ring wearing, deal stealing, toy dealing, high wheel riding, dragonfly flying, son of a gun. And I'm having a hard time keeping these credit card bills down. Welcome to a flare for toys. It's that uncultured heathen. It's your boy Beefs. We here today with another unboxing. I didn't I wasn't for sure what shirt to wear. I didn't know where to wear the turtles. Or the Master of the Universe, because we doing Turtles of Grayskull. So we're going to jump into it. No, we got none other than Slacker. Now, this dude looks pretty cool. This looks like a mix between, I guess it was Faker and Slasher that they mixed together. But he looks really cool. But we're going to get into it. Uh, I don't know how many more, one or two more we got to finish the Metal Bato or whatever. So be glad to get that finished one of these days. But without further ado, do let's get the old man goggles on. <clears throat> we got the flare for toy now. We got the scissors if we need it. And we're going to get into it. And just see what this figure is all about. See if it's as good as it looks in the package as it does in hand. So... It looks like they got a little comic book or something in there. Right there. They probably won't even open that. But got a little instruction thing, I guess, if you need it. I don't know what that's for. But we will probably keep these boxes at least till we build this figure. And then we'll get rid of them. But man, this thing just looks big, chunky, and awesome as all get out. So we're going to get into it and see what he's all about. So let's get these straps cut off of here. We got the big old turtle shell. All right, we got the swords. Got that. There's the head to metal bato. Looking pretty good right there. And then here's the bottom torso. Really? You got that strapped in? No need for that. So, got the metal, to the metal, <laughs> the bottom torso and the head. We we'll eventually get all that put together. Now, let's get the figure out. See what it's all about. Got a few more straps there. Got him free from his plastic prison. Get all the trash out of the way. And let's see what we got. Now, we're not going to do any of that today, but in case you didn't know if you're collecting this line or thinking about collecting this line, the one of the cool things about it is you can change out the parts. You can change the torso, the arms, stuff like that. So you can create whatever you want to create. But there's the back of them without the turtle shell on. There he is. Kind of reminds me of like a, uh, one of them street sharks or something almost. Kind of got that kind of feel to it, but let's see. Stands up. Looking good. But I like the way that chest plate is like tore. And then it's supposed to be like, I guess, gears in there or whatever. But it's like pizza. I don't know if you can see that. Pretty cool little detail right there. So let's see if we can't get this on. See what it looks like with the turtle shell on him. Heroes in a half shell. All right, pops right in. Okay, no issue so far. There it is. <clears throat> see if he still stands up with the heavy turtle shell. All right. Now, I think you can put one of these swords in the back if you wanted. If you didn't want him carrying both of them. So, that's an extra. Always good to be able to carry the weapons. Now, the thing I see, I don't really see these coming with, like, extra hands and different stuff. But. Good Lord. My hands are tight. 
There we go. But that's fine. It makes him hold the knife better. So you can put both swords in his hands if you wanted. You can have one in the backpack. But, man. So what is it called? Slacker? <laughs> All right, looking real good, looking real good. Y'all y'all, let me know in the comments, are y'all in on this line, out on this line, dibble-dabble. I'm all in so far, so y'all let me know. You're going to pick this guy up. You're going to pass on him. So that's what we got for today. Thank y'all for checking me out. I hope y'all like the review. Like I said, these are pretty good figures. They're mixed between Master Universe and Ninja Turtles. When I first heard the line coming out, I was like, man, I don't really need that. But then I saw them. I had to go all in. So thank you for make sure you like, follow, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I may be leaving, but I'm still that uncultured heathen.